morning, loved ones, friends, and new people watching. Man, it is a blessing today. It is December, uh, December 12th, uh, 2021, and I am currently on my way to church. Um, one of the few things in my life that actually hasn't turned its back on me. Um, and with that being said, that's a real blessing. Um, I don't know a lot of you viewers out there, like what's your um, religious background or your makeup, stuff like that. But man, God is good because every time you think you're down for the count, he throws you a bone, he throws in the towel, he does something to keep you alive and keep you going. Um, you know, I wouldn't want to say I'm one of those scary Christians where they're like, you know, you know I like to say I'm a, I'm a human being. I make mistakes. I do sin, I struggle, but I always try to do the best that I can. Um, I want to make right decisions. I want to be a good person. Uh, I like giving back. I like trying my best. And, you know, you go through triumph and you go through destruction. And at the end of that is resurrection and reflection. You know, you get to look back at the mistakes you made and what you can do differently and just keep on pushing it. Uh, it's been a crazy year, as like I've been saying for a while. Um, we're coming to the end where it's going to be 2022. I really hope it is a good year, and I strongly believe it will be for a lot of us. Um, hopefully we don't keep making the same bad habits and mistakes, and we learn from our lessons, and we keep on uh, getting those blessings in. Um, like I said, man, for y'all who stayed with this journey, I really appreciate it. It, and I'm very grateful for y'all um, And that's amazing man Because like I said If you've been uh, watching these videos Or you just found these videos Just looking around browsing um, It is like a, a family hood And it's a journey It's our journey um, Your journey is different from mine I'm different from yours We're looking for different things in life We're trying to uh, make sense of things We're trying to figure things out We're trying to get things right um, And that's what it's all about uh, Keep going, keep pushing Don't give up and really understand why you're going through certain things or you know certain things are happening to you whether you're like it's a test or it's just to see you know uh how you would react in that situation um but like i said uh, what church does for me as if you're any religious makeup I just hope you have faith in general because really what I see to, before I get into that um, if you don't have any religious makeup or you don't believe like you're not going to have faith and if you don't have faith you're going to be a horrible um, in my opinion a husband a brother a sister a girlfriend a boyfriend uh, just a friend just a person because in this world the only thing that we honestly have is faith we don't have anything else and whether you think it's like faith and you know i put my faith in god and jesus and stuff like that if you don't got faith in anything you know it's common sense i mean i don't know why i have to say this to people but if you don't have faith in something or someone or the broad spectrum of things you're not going to have faith in yourself and if you don't have faith in yourself it's going to show in everything your work performance your life your relationships um, and it just keeps on trickling down because that's what helps you get through the day that's what makes you want to push yourself to be the best version that you can be and continually keep on striving to better yourself um, and then you'll have uh, longer relationships and you'll have uh, longer riches and you'll have longer happiness uh, whenever something bad happens to me other than you know meditation and prayer um, you know you guys would probably relate like when you're going through something it's so funny like people will always show you their true colors they just they don't even want to be um, messing around with you like when something bad happens they are so quick uh, to just stay away from you and I understand it I don't agree with it, but I can understand how it's like it makes you feel uncomfortable. You're like, oh, dude, this guy or girl's going through something. Like, I don't, I don't want that being brought over here. Um, but you know, on the other side, I always like being there for people because it shows them for one, like you care. For two, um, it doesn't make them feel like, oh, I'm any less of a person because nobody should feel like that. We're all humans on Earth, and like I said, we all got different goals, but we're doing the same thing. We're trying to find out uh, happiness and trying to get life right. Uh, but some of y'all got to pick up the journey as it is and understand one thing in life, you know. Uh, 
uh, which goes back to what I was saying about church, what I get out of it. It's about understanding that you don't have to have the best. The best is what you make it. And as, as cliche and funny as it sounds, it really is. Like, you know, especially I'm in the, uh, I'm in Michigan. I'm in the America area. So uh, that's my country, America. Uh, we're, we're never satisfied. We need faster cars. We need, we need bigger houses. We need more um, beautiful companionship. Um, you know, we got to keep on searching for this and that. It's never uh, good enough. We need to have cooler friends. We need to have shiny jewelry. We need to have um, the latest shoes and, and all that. And I just don't really believe in that because um, if you, you can try it, but I'll guarantee you that after a while that that stuff's not going to bring you happiness. And as funny as it sounds, happiness does come from within. But you can make a bad situation good and you can always work on yourself if you're like, hey, I'm not good uh, with my weight. You can go to the gym if you say, well, I want to be more smarter. Well, pick up a book, take some college courses. If you say, well, I'm not making enough money, save money. Shoot, you want everybody to say, how do you how do you double your money? You take a dollar bill, you fold it, and you stick it in your pocket and it's there. It's not really what you make. It's what you save. And remember, uh, for some of you guys out there that are trying to impress people, you will go broke doing that. And whether it's a friend or a significant other and you're really trying to like woo them over, well, what are you gonna do when you can't do that anymore? They're just gonna leave and you're gonna be upset. Um, they're not really gonna be upset because they'll probably find someone who can do that. But you wanna keep people around you who want you for you, not because what you can do and you know be a court jester and keep them entertained like, oh, this guy has money, this guy has looks or this, you know, and that's the problem in this world. And and on my side too, you know, um, us as men, you know, we try to do all these things for uh, females and it is sad. You know, they do the, um, the hair transplant. This is my real curly hair. They try to do beard transplant. This is my real beard, you know. It's not a Rick Ross one, but I wouldn't want that because, you know, when you're kissing girls and stuff like that, uh, they will not like that either. Um, they will try to do anything, you know, plastic surgery, like be who you are. Like at the end of the day, there's only so much you can do, um, for yourself. That's why I said, man, uh, keep pushing yourself, but don't make yourself uncomfortable where you don't like yourself. Just go in there strong and keep trying your best and pray and meditate. Make sure you're exercising make sure you're eating good, make sure you're around good people, try to stay away from um, bad music and bad movies, I'm not saying that you have to completely do that, but you got to understand it's just repetition, if I wake up every day and I say, I'm going to become wealthy, I'm going to become wealthy, I'm going to become wealthy, like sooner or later, what's going to happen is it most likely will, whereas if I keep on saying, um, I'm going to be broke. I'm going to be broke. No one loves me. I can't find true love. I can't find a girlfriend. Can't do that. Then that will happen as well. Anyway, y'all, um, I really want to say that I love you guys. I really hope you guys are embarking on your journey and you guys are doing what you're supposed to do. Your meditation, your prayer, go to church, get your sleep, eat well, hang around with good people. Uh, motivate people, share these videos, like these videos, comment on these videos, let me know where you're at in life, let me know, you know, what town, you're going through girl problems, financial problems, let this community grow, I know on YouTube, a lot of people want to see some fake videos or unauthentic, and I don't have the makeup, I don't have the fancy lighting, all I can give you guys is 100% uh, real authentic material. I'm not trying to make all the videos all with the fluorescent lights and the cool things and all that stuff. Let's be authentic for once. You know, in this world, there's been enough fakeness and the fakeness dies out. The fakeness goes away. The fakeness will fade. But the real is here to stay every single day. I love y'all and have a great and blessed day. I'm out.